So ESPN ranked NFL teams under 25's talent. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. So for our under 25 talent, we have Cedric Johnson, we have Amarius Mims, Jermaine Burton, McKinley Jackson, Chris Jenkins, Trey Mosley, Miles Murphy, Eric All Jr. We have Anthony, Jordan Battle, um, Justin, we have Noah Can, we have Elijah Collins, Dax Hill, PJ Rule, Matt Lee, uh, Austin, Josh Newton, the linebacker dude, DJ Turner, Chase Brown, Cole Burgess, uh, Jackson Carmen, Aaron Casey, Jamar freaking Chase, let's go baby, Michael Dowell, Alan George, Cam Grandy, Shaka Haywood, Trey Hill, Yoshi, uh, Poison Ivy, Cedric Jackson, Money Mac, Eric Miller, Joseph Asai, Lance Robinson, Cam Sample, Cam Taylor Britt, Jay, and that's it. Now, obviously the highlights of that under 25 list for us would be Cam Taylor Britt, Jamar Chase, arguably the best receiver in the NFL. Uh, Yoshi is also under 25. Money Mac is under 25. Um, Joseph Asai is under 25. Yeah, so we have a good amount of really good players. Dax Hill as well, under 25. But I feel like based on that like list of players, they're not going to rank us very well. I mean, Chase is really what's going to probably have us up a little bit on this list. But outside of that, you know, they're not going to, for some reason, ESPN, I, they don't trash on Cam Taylor Britt, but I don't think they think he's as good as we know he is. So, let's just look at what they say. Number one, Houston Texans. Okay, they got CJ Shaw, Will Anderson Jr., and Derek Singley Jr. Honestly, if I had to put us on that list, I say we're top 10. I think that list right there. In a top 10 list. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go top 10. Detroit Lions, Penny Sewell, Aiden Hutchinson, Sam Laporta, Monmouth St. Brown, Gibbs. Yeah, that's, that's the issue. There is a lot of good players under 25. And I feel like every year, the NFL is getting more and more OP with it. Kyle Hamilton, Zay Flowers, Tyler Lindenbaum, and Patrick Queen. Hey, 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 no. This is cheating. I don't care that you put left in free agency. He is on the Schittsburg Squealers right now. That is bullcrap. You cannot use that as a player. Anyway. Uh, Atlanta Falcons, AJ Terrell, Michael Penix, Bijan Robinson, Drake uh, London, and Kyle Pitts. I mean, Michael Penix never played. And arguably, he might not play for the next four years. So... I, I, I disagree with this. I think we have a better roster. I think we have better under 25 than this roster right here. I think we have a better 25 than this roster right here. Uh, so far, Detroit and Houston are the only ones I would say who could be arguably better than us. Chicago, Caleb Williams, Darnell Wright, Roman Duze, Braxton Hill, Jaquan Brisker, and Justin Fields. How can you say Justin Fields? He got traded. Like, I, I, it's not like he's in the process of being traded. He was traded. He is no longer on your roster. I, I thought the point of this was players on your roster right now, not players who played for you. Because then we could go through a whole entire another list for us. How old is Jesse Bates? No, Jesse Bates is kind of old, actually. Yeah, no, I think we're better than the Chicago. So I think we're higher than every team except for the top two here. Paris Johnson, Marvin Harrison Jr., Michael Wilson, and Zayvon Collins. You know, I loved last year watching Marvin Harrison Jr. in the NFL. Oh, wait, he didn't play in the NFL last year because we're just projecting. Come on now. Jacksonville Jaguars. Outside of Trayvon Walker, and even then, Chase is way better. Okay, now I'm kind of feeling like this list is stupid. Cam Taylor Bright is better than all three of these guys. Both of these guys as well. And Jamar Chase. Rams. Like, Rams should be higher. Puka Nakua, Steve, and Byron Young. I feel like they should be a little bit higher up the list compared to these other teams. 
Green Bay Packers, uh, Jalen Reed, Jordan Love. Yo, know, like this should this should be higher up the list too. ESPN, who do you have working for you, man? Cause I, I feel like these lists are kind of like all over the place here. Last year they were seventeenth, thirty second. Last year they were fifth. Last year they were twenty eighth, twelfth, eighth, thirtieth, three. And then last year they were one. So Texans were one back to back years. I mean, yeah, they had CJ Stroud. If you have a big name quarterback who's young, you're going to get up that list. Um, Sauce Gardner, Garrett Wilson. Like, this should be high on this list. This is really good. Oh, man. Anthony Richardson, Latou, Kitty Pay. To put Jamar Chase on the list that's outside of the top 15 is just insanity. Especially when you're looking at it based on, again, future prospects. The Giants do not have Kayvon Thibodeau. There's literally Giants fans who want to get rid of him because they say he's a draft bust. Deontay Banks, he's pretty good. Malik Neighbors hasn't played yet. Andrew Thomas and John Michael Smith Jr. The Queefs are above us. Trent McDuffie is really good, I'm not going to lie. George Kalafkis is also very good. Creed Humphrey, Isaiah Pacheco. These guys are really good, but I think that we should be higher. Where are we actually ranked is my question. Okay. Ain't no way. Ain't no way you not. You, you really blue chip players. The only guy you're going to talk about is Jamar Chase. We got Cam Taylor Britt on that roster, but my man's. That is insane. We also got Dax Hill. Yeah. I mean, bruh. And if we're talking about potential and projecting players like they have already played in the NFL, how is Amarius Mims, Chris Jenkins, and... Uh, maybe not him. But Chris Jenkins, Amarius Mims, how are they not up there? Come on, ESPN. Bruh. Last year we were 14, so they're saying our roster is worse. Our 20 top 25 roster. I think we're way better than a lot of these teams. Honestly. I think our I think that's insane. Cowboys, we got the we got the tits. We got the 49ers. The Vikings. Patriots. Yeah, I would probably put this list in a lot different area. Like, I, I would completely change around this list. I don't agree with this list at all. I mean, I think they have teams that I think are just should be way below us. And I think there's teams that should be higher up. Maybe not above us, but way higher up. I think we're top 10. Cam Taylor Britt is one of the best in the league. Same thing with, obviously, Jamar Chase. I don't know. Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. Maybe I'm crazy. I'll see you guys in the next one. Who did?